Okay, so t today I'm going to talk about Caitlin Bennett. Yeah, remember the uh, Kentucky uh, State Gun Girl? Yeah, that one. Yeah, the one that posted a picture of her graduation last year, I think, or two years ago, when she was in a white dress and, of course, she had a gun, which went viral on social media, and she's now a well-known bigot. And, well, this happened. All right, she tweeted by saying, this soy boy that followed me around the campus for four hours is trying to say I was bothering him for being gay. Meanwhile, a gay guy was trying to take a photo with me and tell him to cut it out. This formation is great, isn't it? Well, actually, Caitlin, you are the one that makes a lot of disinformation, like every day. You keep doing that. And now, I'm about to actually show you the clip of the latest incident that Caitlin put up. And then the other latest incident, and, and then the other part of the latest incident that I'm about to show you from the guy who actually had Twitter and posted it. A guy named Joshi says, enjoy this video of me just wearing a Rosalia sweatshirt and getting told you're obviously gay by Caitlyn Bennett. I'm gay, like, it's okay. I don't okay. care. Oh, cool. Yeah. So wait, wait, so you so have you're, that same, you but you're not being rude because you're gay, you're just being rude to be rude. Just, just go get, get a latte. Get and harass and call it doesn't matter. See how many people are You're around. harassing her. She's you not a college her. student at the University of Akron. Who cares? It's a public Everybody. University. Her taxes are around. Here. No, she doesn't. No, I don't know. This is getting a picture. This is getting a picture. She doesn't live in Akron. We're eating state Do you live in Akron, Ohio? This is a state university. Do you live in Akron, Ohio? This is a state university. Okay, just the freaks. I'll take the cell phone. Oh, you okay? Yeah, I'll take it. Okay. And if you want to have I'm kind of tall here. I'll just go up to people and be nice about them. Oh, wait. Like, don't oh, like, like you're doing right now. You're so <laughs> you're nice. Aren't I you? am being nice. It's okay. Just walking by and I saw you talking to me. Okay. That's a really nice person. You're having a debate with people. You can actually have a debate. All right. Yeah, I'm good. I'm extremely cool. You too. All right. Thank you. He's such a nice guy. Joel, I think he likes you. I hope not. I really don't. Now, let me get my take on this by watching the same video again and explain my reaction to it. I'm gay. Like, it, it's okay. I don't you know? care. Oh, cool. Yeah. So wait, wait. So you have that same, you but you're not being rude bro. because you're gay. You're just being rude to be rude. Just, just go get a latte. And harass me. It doesn't matter. You see how many people are You're around. harassing her. She's you not a college her. student at the University of Akron. Who cares? It's a public Everybody. university. Everybody. Her taxes are around. Here. He's right. He, she is not a college student at the University of Akron. Why the hell is Caitlin Bennett doing here? Bothering people asking dumb questions. That's what she's doing. Let's no, she's not. Caitlin, it is a yes or no question. Do you live in Akron, Ohio? Be nice and answer his question, you jackass. Okay. And if you want to have I'm kind of tall here, I'll just go up to people and be nice about them. Oh, wait. Don't oh, like, like you're doing right now. You're so <laughs> you're nice. Aren't I you? am being nice. It's okay. Just walking by and I saw you talking to you. That's a really nice person. You're having a debate with people. You can actually have a Yeah, I'm good. I'm extremely cool. You too. All right. Thank you. He's such a nice guy. Joel, I think he likes you. I hope not. I really don't. I stand with Josh on everything he said because. Caitlin is always the person who comes over to 
any place, especially a college campus like this, and harass people all the time. The stupid question said, nobody needs to answer to a dumb girl who clearly has a college degree, but doesn't know everything since she wanted to uh, become a right, a right wing journalist for a media company that does not represent American values called Liberty Hangout. And in fact, speaking of that name, it also does not represent or reflect the Statue of Liberty. Let me bring you another clip now by reading this. Actually, scratch that. I have a video of it. I'm going to bring it to you right now. Say it again, now that I have it on camera. Come on, say it again. You're gay. Say it again, now that I have it on camera. Come on, say it again. You're gay. Here, since y'all wanted proof, this is what Joshi wrote. When people were probably asking about Caitlin Bennett calling him by saying, you're gay. In a really disgusting tone of voice. She said it like she, like she has friends who, uh, talk like they're divas. And she's pretty much like that. Caitlin Bennett is pretty much a communist, uh, right-wing diva who wants to bother so many people by getting all the questions out there that she wants everyone to answer in a smart way possible and unfortunately her questions are not pretty much well thought out and so Yeah. Alright, let's go to the next part. Pretty much says it says it says it all. And uh yeah, I'll just read it. You're gay. Imagine using that as an insult in two thousand twenty. I know, right? I mean seriously. Caitlin Bennett has to do better than that. I mean, this is why she is the worst human being that ever existed in the first place. Because she is known for these dumb acts that she's been pulling through, through since her uh, popular tweet about her holding a gun behind her, her back at her old college that she just graduated from, which is Kent State. And this is pretty much why she is the worst. Now, let me bring you this. Yes, you should act like a man and not a little bitch. Okay. That's what you should act like. And you should act like a decent human being. Uh, Rosalia! Do you know who that These is? These are the men. Do you know who that is? This is not our society. Do you know who that is? is be. That's They're because you're be white and right. you don't know any other language besides English. Educate yourself. Get a degree. Learn another language. Here we go. Wise words from the man who destroyed Caitlin Bennett. Wise words from a man who destroyed Caitlin Bennett. He's a gay man, and he has wise words for her. He destroyed her because 
Caitlin Bennett is uneducated and she learned all different languages instead of be instead of being this snobby rich kid of an American that she is then she would know a, a thing or two when she happens to speak to people in different languages. I mean, I must admit, even I can't bear to speak a different language because it's hard. But for Caitlin Bennett, ah, she's uneducated on everything. And this shows everything that has to do with her. I'm glad that this guy exposed the fuck out of her. I mean, come on. Caitlin Bennett's been... She's been known to do these dumb acts that she's been doing for, like, five years. Apparently five years. And we have not heard of Liberty Hangout until, well, recently. Recently, a while ago. Probably due to Caitlin's graduation. And maybe possibly before that. Probably around where, uh, She, in 2018, had to go viral. Or at least have to poke at the, uh, Parkland School shooting survivors. I mean, come on. This is who Caitlin Bennett is. She's, she's a narcissist. Like, come on. Why does she have to be here on planet Earth? Why does she have to be here tormenting people? This is all she's been doing for a while. I don't understand how. And I don't think I ever will understand how she is able to torment people. Ay, ay, ay. Like, come on. She is completely and utterly stupid. Like, come on. And if I see that Liberty Hangout video tomorrow, yes, it's gonna, it's probably gonna be edited out of everything. Because she met the guy who's now gonna be on YouTube. After me, of course, because I'm uploading this, well, tomorrow. By the time you're watching this, it's already tomorrow. And, yeah. I'm going to expose her before Liberty Hangout ex expose themselves. Because that's what they do. They expose themselves for being stupid. And that gay guy... Educated Caitlin Bennett right to her fucking face, right to her donkey ass pig pig face, and told her exactly how he feels. And I fucking love him for that. Caitlin Bennett, 
Maybe one day, maybe one day, if you were as smart as Josh, then maybe you would actually be a much better person for it. Maybe you wouldn't have to keep walking up to people every time in a college campus or any place else and as the most outrageous ridiculous dumb questions I'm serious maybe you you would be much smarter if you didn't go out there and parade on everyone else's lives with your own antics, since they all know who you are on social media. I even know who you are. And I'm not stupid to know that you are the most shittiest person on planet Earth. I hope to God that one day you actually stop doing this bullshit and actually take care of your own child because you're not going to get a lot of money for being an anti-American conservative journalist and harass people all day long with these annoying questions and bothering people. So, yeah. <sighs> oh, yeah, yeah. I kind of wish that one day, maybe, maybe you'll turn over a new leaf, but. The only problem is that you won't, you won't turn over a new leaf, and that's fine, because, no way, that's not fine, because if you don't turn over a new leaf, you will be the most hated person in America for a very, very long time. So, I'm going to ask you to do, when you do get married, please, retire your fucking job from Liberty Hangout. Don't ever do it again when you have kids. When you have kids, be a working stay-at-home mom. Do not even try taking your mic and go and your husband, your future husband, and go out there and harass more people. Don't you even dare do that. Just take care of your future children when you actually have babies. Retire Liberty Hangout for a while and take care of your children. You're more important than that stupid shit that you do now. Oh, and by the way, Patreon? Really? Patreon is not the best way to get an income source. YouTube memberships are. No wonder you keep begging people to give you your, give you money for Patre for for your Patreon. Liberty Hangout isn't the most popular YouTube channel of all time. PewDiePie is the most popular YouTube channel of all time. Liberty Hangout? Not. And that's the truth. So stop asking people to give you your Patreon. <laughs>